Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Packet Tracer on your Windows computer. I already have a Packet Tracer version on my computer. This is the Packet Tracer I have. If you look at Help and About, you will see what version of the Packet Tracer you have on your computer. I do have all the version, which is 8.0.1. You can say 8.0 right now they updated the version to 8.2 however i cannot update from here i do not have any tab saying update so i need to uninstall or i need to install on top of the current version so i'm going to uninstall the older version of the packet tracer and install the new version of the packet tracer so basically if you are looking to install the latest version of the packet tracer i'm going to show you how to download and install the latest version of the packet tracer i go to add remove programs look for packet tracer this is the version i have i'm going to uninstall it now i have successfully removed the packet tracer from my computer some programs may ask you to restart the computer but packet tracer did not ask to do so now i'm going to show you how to install the packet tracer to download the latest version of the packet tracer open up your favorite web browser i'm going to open microsoft edge and going to type in cisco packet tracer download i'm going to look for the network academy website this is the net acad site this is the official site you can download the packet tracer and you go to down here this is where you download the packet tracer go to view courses and you need to go to skill for all and then you can start to download the packet tracer from here choose which language you want to download the packet tracer i'm going to select english get started you need to have a login to download the cisco packet tracer as you know i already went with the skill for all so you need to create an account for skill for all otherwise you can have networking academy login or nowadays you also can use i guess google account as a third party login but i do have a network academy account but if you do not have one just go here go to sign up and then you select your country date of birth so let's try this one i'm going to say united states date of birth say 1985 select month october continue the first name last name email address and then you can create a password and then you can be done with the account creation so i'm going to go to my network academy account so now i am logged in using my network academy account after you log into the account you go to this getting started with cisco packet tracer resume course because i started a course before that's why it is asking to resume the course. So click on this module one, download and use Cisco Packet Tracer. And you go down here, install Cisco Packet Tracer. And this is where you download the Cisco Packet Tracer. Click on this link and go down and look for download the version of the Packet Tracer you require. I'm going to select 8.2 point one windows and now you see the packet tracer is downloading it is not a big package so it will download very quickly within 30 seconds and now you open the file click yes and i'm going to accept the license agreement if you do not accept it won't let you to install and then click next 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 unless you want to change this installation folder you can keep clicking next and accept the defaults i'm going to say create a quick launch shortcut also install
Down here, you can see the system requirements for the installation computer with either Windows 10 11 or Mac OS 10.14 or newer or Ubuntu 20.04 or 22 or 22.04. And also you need to have 4 GB of free RAM and 1.4 GB of free disk space to install Packet Tracer. Installation is now complete. Launch Cisco Packet Tracer. Would you like to run multi-user when application starts? I would say yes. Now it will prompt you to log in either using your Cisco Academy account or Skill for All account. I'm going to use this one. So now I am logged into the Packet Tracer. Let's go and check the version about. And now you can see the version is updated to 8.2.1 and so and so. So I am on the latest version of the Cisco Packet Tracer. So this is how you update or install Packet Tracer on your Windows computer. If this video is helpful for you, give me a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on notification for helpful networking videos.